Now, here's a picture of the networks we established for that project. So starting on the upper right uh, corner, you see 1,400 people we motivated to become guides. So learning partners, change partners, their role models, their focus is on skills and mindset to really personalize change behaviors. Then on the lower right, we have the knowledge brokers, not knowledge managers anymore, but knowledge brokers. They support us with their knowledge and help answering questions. We established a social support forum to make the, the support process transparent again, because support is nothing but learning. I have a question and I need an answer. And since we delegated that so many years, people lack, have a lack now of asking good questions. So we had to establish that again to make living knowledge uh, visible again. Living knowledge, I mean, knowledge which is going back and forth between people. And last but not least, um, we have the organizational coordinators, which are more connected to the, to the business, of course, and the local evergreen teams, 2,500 people who made things or who realized things in the local culture in China, in Singapore, in, in Mexico, and so on. Yeah, so, and those networks were connected. They were learning from each other. So they, they had different organizational styles. So that was a complete new organizational structure based on transparency, leadership, and working with complexity.